Hey guys, what's up? Icebreaker here. I'm going to um, show you guys how to attack Taper. Um, this is a solo attack done by Suitman in our task force. <clears throat> As you can see, it's quite a standard sort of layout. There are normally some machine guns here, but this one's got rocket launchers on the top, so it's still a three shock. Rocket launchers, flamethrowers, and this one over here. This one over here does tend to give people some trouble. Um, you see people splitting it, and you'll see in a minute how Suitman miss misses this shark, and he has to put another one down. So I've got a picture here showing you exactly where the shock point is. Um, so what we'll do is we'll get straight into it. First of all, we're going to clear the mines. Those ones. The two on the end there. And the four shot mines up here. You don't need to worry about these ones in the corner here. Okay, so flare needs to go on the beach, right down into the water, nice and low. This is so when the zookas come off the boat, they don't walk up the beach, they walk down the beach, grouping them up nice and tight. Okay, so your first flare point then is in front of this machine gun. Getting your smokes down. Next flare point, he chooses to go top side of the mortar. But you can come down uh, in front of the boom cannon here as well. Sort of to the left of this corner mortar. Anywhere along that line there in between the mortars and the boom cannons there. Anywhere along across that line is fine. Smoking them up through. That's the path they're going to take up through the middle there. Next flare is this one here. Double smoke because they're going to spread a little bit when you flare core. So what we're going to do is we're going to shock the flamethrowers first. One because they're closest and they'll do a lot of damage. But also because they don't have the delay. Um, as soon as the smoke expires they will start burning up zookas. Whereas rocket launchers have three second delay. Machine guns will fire straight away. So you always shock flamethrowers and machine guns first and then anything else, rocket launchers, mortars, those types of things. Um, unless you lose the delay on the way up, in which case you have to shock everything before the smoke expires anyway. Okay, so as you can see, that's, that shot there is literally one tile off. You can see how it's missed the bottom rocket launcher here. So I've got that picture there to show you where exactly where that shot point is. Flamethrowers are shocked. Rocket launchers up here are shocked. The machine guns that would normally be here on the right hand side, they need to be shocked. You can actually um, shock these four flamethrowers here and the corner machine gun in one shock. Um, you know, if, if the machine guns and the flamethrowers are there, you can catch the ones you need to in one shock. It's this shock over this side that gives people the grief. So that picture I showed um, shows you exactly where the shock point is. So that's tape here, guys. If you um, if this video has helped you, give it a like. If you manage to get your first solo after watching this, make sure you post the video in the group for us all to see. Good luck, guys. Hope you